everyone. Welcome to Storytime. My name is Miss Kayla. When you travel, how do you get from here to there? Do you ride your bike or sail on a boat? Do you roll on your skateboard or ride in a car? Or maybe you use your imagination. No matter how you travel, why don't you come with me to the Frisco Heritage Museum where we will learn about how people in Frisco got from here to there. Come on! All right, let's travel back in time before we had cars or scooters or hoverboards and we are going to travel in a covered wagon. Kids would ride in these wagons to go from here to there. But you know, a wagon ride is kind of bumpy. Why don't we sing a song about bumping up and down in our little covered wagon? Can you bounce with me? Here we go. Bumping up and down in my little covered wagon. Bumping up and down in my little covered wagon. Bumping up and down in my little covered wagon. Won't you be my darling? Great job. You know, the word w wagon starts with a letter. What letter does that word start with? That's right, the letter W. Can you think of some other traveling words that begin with the letter W? That's right, wheel. Wheel begins with W. Our wagon has wheels. How else can you travel that starts with a W? Well, that's right, you can walk. Walk begins with W. Great job. <music> Traveling in covered wagons took a long time to get from here to there. People wanted to travel further, faster. So they invented trains. Now people could travel really far distances much faster. In fact, trains are so important that they're the reason the town of Frisco is here at all. Why don't we say a little rhyme about the cars on a train? I think I hear a train coming down the track. Now what sound does a train make when it comes down the track? That's right, clickety-clack, clickety-clack. Can you make that sound with me? Here we go, clickety-clack. Clickety-clack, here comes the train rolling down the track. Clickety-clun, clickety-clun, here comes engine number one. Clickety-clue, clickety-clue, here comes coal car number two. Clickety-clee, clickety-clee, here comes box car number three. Clickety-clore, clickety-clore, here comes oil car number four. Clickety-clack, clickety-clack, say goodbye to the train on the track. Bye! We learned that with trains, people can travel further and faster. But not everyone has a train parked in their front yard. But now, with the invention of cars, like the 1913 Model T Ford, people could have these parked right in their driveways, and they could go from here to there faster than ever before. My friend, Old MacDonald, he has a car just like this one, and he loves to drive it. Let's sing a song about Old MacDonald's car to the tune of Old MacDonald Had a Farm. Here we go. Old MacDonald had a car, E-I-E-I-O, and on his car there was a motor, E-I-E-I-O, with a vroom vroom here and a vroom vroom there. Here a vroom, there a vroom, everywhere a vroom vroom. Old MacDonald had a car, E-I-E-I-O. What other things can you see on Old MacDonald's car? Well, that's right, it has wheels. Can you make your wheels roll with me? Here we go. Old MacDonald had a car, E-I-E-I-O. And on his car there were some wheels, E-I-E-I-O. With the roll, roll here and a roll, roll there. Here a roll, there a roll, everywhere a roll, roll. Old MacDonald had a car, E-I-E-I-O. Let's find one more thing on Old MacDonald's car. What do you see? I see headlights. Can you make them blink? Here we go. 
Old MacDonald had a car, E-I-E-I-O, and on his car there were some headlights, E-I-E-I-O, with a blink blink here and a blink blink there, here a blink, there a blink, everywhere a blink blink, Old MacDonald had a car, E-I-E-I-O. Great job, everyone. You know, old MacDonald doesn't just have a car. He loves lots of things that go. Let's read about all the things he likes in Old MacDonald's Things That Go by Jane Clark. Maybe you can sing this book while I read. Let's see. Old MacDonald's Things That Go. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. And on his farm, he had a what is he riding? A bike. He loved things that go. With a ding ding here and a ding ding there. Here a ding, there a ding, everywhere a ding ding. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. What else can he ride? Let's see. Oh, and on that farm he had a truck. What color is his truck? Can you see some other animals driving trucks? He loved things that go with a vroom vroom here and a vroom vroom there. Here a vroom, there a vroom, everywhere a vroom vroom. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. Let's see where else he can go. Look, he's on the water. What does he have now? That's right. And on that farm he had a boat. He loved things that go with a splash splash here and a splash splash there. Here a splash, there a splash, everywhere a splash splash. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. He's gotten a boat. What else can we ride? A train. And on that farm he had a train. He loved things that go with a choo choo here and a choo choo there. Here a choo, there a choo, everywhere a choo choo. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. My goodness, he does have a lot of ways to travel. Even an airplane. And on that farm he had a plane. He loved things that go. With a zoom zoom here and a zoom zoom there. Here a zoom, there a zoom, everywhere a zoom zoom. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. Oh, look at all the things that go on his farm. And they're racing to the finish line. Old MacDonald had a farm. He loved things that go. The end. If you would like to read the whole version of this book that we have shortened, you can check it out from Frisco Public Library. Thank you all so much for coming to Storytime today. Make sure to check out the Frisco Heritage Museum to learn more about the historic ways people in Frisco traveled. And of course, if you want to take Storytime home with you, check out our blog, Storytime at Home, from here to there. We'll see you next time. Bye!